This video, sponsored by AE Juice. Hey everyone, welcome back to my After Effects tutorial. Today, we are going to render the transparent video in After Effects. So let's get started. Open After Effects. And this is a very basic animation I have created for this episode. Just a simple in and out animation. For making a transparent video, make sure your project is transparent. If you have a background, then you should hide or delete it. Now click on this toggle transparency grid icon to confirm the background is transparent. It will look like these checker box. Not cool. Let's turn it off because it looks trippy. Now we are going to export this project. So go to the composition and then choose add to render queue. It will open a new tab. The first option is the render setting. You can keep the default value for it. So I'm not focusing on it. The next one is the output module. And this is important. Click on the lossless and it will open up a new window. We will play with some settings here. This first one is the format. Click on it and a bunch of formats will appear. Please note, only a few formats support the transparency, not everyone. So I am going to use the quick time. You can also use the PNG sequence, but it will export the frames in the image sequence. And images don't support the audio. So if you have the audio in your project, it won't work in this format. Let's select the quick time. And then click on this format options button. A new window will appear. This time we are going to change the codec setting. So click on the video codec, and select the animation. Everything else will remain the same. Click OK, or press the Enter, to eject from this window. Now the most important thing. In the video output, click on the channels, and make sure to select the RGB plus alpha. The RGB only contains the color channel, and it won't support the transparency. The alpha, only supports transparency. And it won't show any color. But the RGB plus alpha supports color, as well as the transparency. And it will be the best choice for making a transparent video. Everything else will remain the same. If you have the audio, you can keep the audio output on. I am not using any sound in this project, so I am changing the audio output off. Hit OK, and we are good to go. The only thing has left is the output too. This option allows choosing a destination, as well as the name of this output file. Now all you need to do is click on this render button. It will start exporting the file right away. You can also do the same, using the Adobe Media Encoder. Adobe Media Encoder, supports many more formats, as well as, decreasing the file size. But we will cover it later. Let me know in the comments, if you need a video on it. Now hit the render key, and wait for the render to be finished. Cool. Close this render queue tab, and let's check the transparent video. Import the rendered video into your project, then grab it, and place it onto the composition icon. It will create a new composition using the same frame size as the video. Let's import one more video into the project. I am placing it right below the animation layer. And see, it does not have any background. You can place it anywhere you want. And done. So this is how you can render a video, without any background. Thank you for watching this tutorial. I'll see you in the next one. Till then, good luck, and peace. Special thank you to our partner, AE Juice. Check out their Liquid Elements Pack. Over a thousand frame by frame animations for your projects. It comes with a handy pack manager, basically, it is a huge asset library on demand. Press the shortcut to open the plugin, drag and drop and you're done. This is one of those investments that last your lifetime. The links are in the description.